Harry Aguado worked in the music business as a lyricist and composer for nearly 30 years. When the effects of a devastating disease threatened to end his career, JVS helped him develop a unique solution. What I have is a hereditary disease called Stargardt's. Random cells in the center of my retina, which is called the macula, which is used for fine tuning and focusing, die. And as my doctor pointed out, that would probably not result in blindness. But he said that my old age might look like a Surratt painting. As my eyes progressed, things became more complicated. I went over and sat down at the piano and realized I could not read any of my own music. I could not play any of the parts back and I couldn't conduct the rehearsal and it was heartbreaking. It's very isolating and what it has meant in the long term for me is that 30 years of work are basically sketched and in fragments. What he needed is some assistance with assistive technology and learning how to use it so that the tools that he's used to using are accessible to him. With the help of JVS, I was able to develop a specific business plan and timeline which would allow me through a series of very practical steps to achieve my goals. My CCTV is a new system which has a 42 inch flat screen plasma monitor, a Yamaha keyboard, a six track mixer, uh, two MIDI interfaces. There's a series of microphones and other devices for recording directly. But the 42 inch monitor you can imagine gives me quite a degree of visibility. Given everything, his plan, his expertise, I think he is going to fly with it. Last night I was sitting at this equipment and I didn't know whether to laugh or to cry. Um, the world all of a sudden is flooding back uh, to me with opportunity. For the first time I feel, since I can remember, that I am whole and that my promise is whole. Through JVS and all of the assistive technology that I was able to obtain, I was able not only to catch up for the years that I had lost due to my progressive eye loss, but I was also able to take giant leaps forward and made it possible for me to do any number of projects that I never would have been able to do before. I became literate in these formats and in these technologies. As they evolved, I was able to evolve with ease. So the current state-of-the-art forms of all of these technologies are the ones that I'm using. Once it, you play it in the piano, it evaporates. Having this studio has been central to what I would consider my mature development as an artist. Since 2004, I've been able to create a number of new projects. The one that matters most to me is a brand new musical theater piece, my latest work, Home. I took the tracks that I had generated here with my equipment to Tom Grief's studio in Hancock Park where we recorded lead vocal, backup vocal parts. We laid some piano on top of it. She got it, great. Right. Now right. piano up. I looked for ways that I could possibly start to give back to my community. One of my proudest accomplishments was writing a grant that resulted in a national award to the city of West Hollywood for its work for the disabled. This resulted in a check for $25,000 which we set aside for assistive technology in the new West Hollywood Library. Thanks to JVS, I'm fully equipped I have the capacity to bring my work to the audiences and people that it was meant for. You have loved him and let him go. Perfect. Well done.